today we're going to try to use that device on you again. The one that's supposed to revive your memories. Why are we doing that in here? Like, next to the prisoners? Right now everyone's trying to move the equipment out of here in case the aliens come back to attack us. And we're staying in the center of the building in case they do. So yeah, let me go get that device. Oh, thank you. What was that? You saw nothing. I made a few adjustments to it a few hours ago, so it should be working now. Alright. Be prepared for a nostalgia fest. This amethyst girl was your childhood friend, right? Well, let's see if you can remember anything significant. Out of all the houses in Parkville, I would have never guessed there was some high-tech alien lab underneath this house. This is still pretty cool, though. <gasps> she wasn't here this morning. <gasps> that means Mom's already home. We gotta get out of here. But her car's not in the parking lot. That doesn't mean I'm not here. Is he the friend you made a few days ago? Julia? Yes? After this boy has left this house, do not speak to him. Do not make contact with him. Do not even look at him. We do not want his memories of this day resurfaced. Don't worry, kid. It won't hurt. Erase his memory. Alright. Hold still. Alright, so, uh, what now? Alright then, I'm just gonna take the chip and, uh, scan it and stuff and game to go because the rest of my explanation is just nerdy stuff you would never understand by. Hey. What can I do? Can I have, like, a job here since I'm stuck in this place and I'm not allowed to go home? Well, it depends on what you're good at. What subjects do you succeed at in school? History. So what do I do? You could document everything we do. So we can keep it as for historical records in case we win and this becomes a famous war. Uh, that sounds boring. Oh, and I'm sure sleeping in a grave is much less boring. Would you rather do that? No, no, I wouldn't. Then do something, or leave me alone. You know what? I'll interrogate the aliens. Yeah, I'll make them crack. I'll make sure they spill the beans. That way, the, they'll tell us everything. And we can win, and they'll stop being jerks and stuff. Yeah, I'll get onto that. Who are you, and why are you attacking us? I'm not telling you my name, and we attacked you because you overheard us, obviously. Besides... You're all too dumb to understand. We're more advanced than you. No, you're not. We have iPhones. Get lost. I'll be back, and I'll make sure you crack. I didn't mean for that to rhyme. What do you want? Answers. That's what I want. You know, our whole plan is stupid, so I'm just gonna talk. See, I'm kind of like a general among the aliens. And, uh, right now we're just looking for every, uh, secret alien prison so we can get out of here and explode the Earth. Where can we find your leader? We need to stop them. Our main base is hidden in the Pacific. Around Hawaii. It's heavily guarded and you might have to kill some of us. I don't want to kill people. Yeah, me neither. But I was kind of forced into this. In fact, a lot of our recruits are. <sighs> 
Well, apparently their main base is somewhere around Hawaii, and uh, we might have to kill some of them to get through. <sighs> We're going to be attacking a hidden alien base in Hawaii. Well that's great, but we're going to have to head somewhere else first. That place will be, um, let's see... Out of all the houses in Parkville, Go ask the boss if we can go. He should say yes. I mean, this is pretty important. Be right back. Mr. Johans? What is it, Mrs. Robbins? I, but I have to do a little side mission in uh, Arizona. So can I talk about Arizona? If you ever request anything as stupid as that again, you're fired. And you know what happens when you're fired, right? Seriously, you won't let me go. Get out of my office. Are you trying to settle different and more important matters? What are you doing on the monitor? Stuff. Important stuff. <sighs> Much better. Well, the boss won't let us go because he thinks it's a stupid idea. Okay, look, I'm an official um, employee here. And when you become an official employee, we get chips implanted in our heads so they can track us. And yeah, so if I go to Arizona, he's going to kill me. But I'm pretty sure you don't have a chip in you, because you're not really an employee. You are working for us, though. You know where this facility is located, right? We are in a secret bunker somewhere in... Nebraska, I think. Yeah, Nebraska. There's definitely going to be some planes heading out to Hawaii tomorrow. So, I need you to sneak aboard one, and once it flies over Arizona, you just drop off the parachute, of course. And find your way to Parkville, uh, Timothy Street, something. I'll write it down. This is so crazy. Can't, can't believe I'm agreeing to do this. The rooms will get dark, so, uh, yeah. Good luck. I'm gonna hit the sack, because I'm tired. Alright, it's time to leave. Crap, it's already getting dark. You heard the lady on the speaker. Hurry up and shut down everything so we can head to bed. I'll close it. I'll lock it down, but I gotta use the bathroom break. But, 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 uh, but I gotta... Uh... Bye. The heck? Alright, I'm back, Rebecca. Well, where'd you go? Oh crap. Uh, just. Let's get going. Who knocked this ladder down over here? Alright everyone, let's move out. Did anyone hear something? Guys, we're already over Arizona. This is so awesome. How fast is this thing? Stay away from the side. Oh crap, oh crap. Uh, what do I do, what do I do? Uh, 
So where exactly am I? Hmm. Oh. Wait. Time to get going. Huh. Almost there. This is the place. And who might you be? An old friend. The name's Thomas Lloyd. Get inside the house now. Give me the gun and get inside the house now. You think your stupid crossbow's gonna beat my laser gun? This is an alien crossbow. Do you know what it does? No. It's like a regular crossbow except alien-ish. It shoots arrows that are faster than the speed of light. And it will blast your brains open. So get inside. Get moving now. <gasps>